Once upon a time, in 1981, the three Malde brothers stood on the shores of the Indian Ocean. As they gazed into the horizon, watching the crimson sun slowly rising as it turned golden yellow, Ramesh mooted an idea to his brothers Naresh and Anil. Let us make the best cooking oil in Kenya, maybe even Africa, better yet, the world. That will make the best meals, the brothers concurred and have dedicated their lives to the idea ever since. There began the humble beginnings of Pwani oil. The first plant in Mombasa started production of coconut oil, then in 1985 continued to corn, then sunflower oil, before evolving to palm oil in 1988. Today, their dream has borne fruit with a state-of-the-art factory in Jomvu that has a capacity of refining over 650 metric tons per day. The products conform to the highest international standards. The brothers' vision grew even bigger. Pwani continued to grow its portfolio of products which saw the launch of Ndume as the first soap and in 2008 opened a new production facility in Kekambala which produced Diva Beauty Soap, Diva Glycerin and Whitewash Multipurpose Bar Soaps of the finest international quality. If all Pwani brands are to be lined up, it would be a magnificent rainbow. The Malde brothers' journey of innovation and diversification did not end there. Salit joined the fold of hero brands in the edible oils category. After 16 years, Whitewash Multipurpose Bar Soap range got an upgrade of Whitewash Extra, a laundry bar soap with three unique properties, a first of its kind in Kenya. As a true Kenyan company, their journey has seen the introduction of B2B products such as Energy Compound, Pwani Pa Wax and Hotel Round Soap. The innovation of these products is unique in the Kenyan market, which prior to Pwani's venture were all imported. The story is not complete as we continue to introduce and acquire more brands. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I want to welcome you in these turbulent pandemic COVID related times. And I want to say that the times are very tough, times are very difficult, and the pandemic has obviously caused some stirs all over the world. I am pleased though that I haven't heard from any of you, my business partners, of any calamities in as far as Corona is concerned. And I'm happy that you are all well and wish that you continue to be well and safe. Ladies and gentlemen, whilst we all talk about the tough times ahead and the toughness that the markets have given us uh, in, in the last few months, and we expect that to continue in the next few months, we need to continue to be doing business. In Kenya, we know that as Kenyans, we are resilient, we are strong, and we will overcome all the issues that the world brings to us. We've done that in the past and we'll continue to do that in the future. Whilst the pandemic is causing stirs in the world, in Pwani, we believe that we need to cause stirs in the Kenyan market and indeed in the regional market of East Africa. With that, we have now brought to you a new way of launching products. Remember in the past, we've invited you to Mombasa on many occasions and done some physical launches of various new initiatives and innovations that we've come up with over time. This time, for the first time in the history of Pwani, we do a virtual launch. On the 1st of July this year, we officially took over the brand name Ushindi from PZ Cousins. We are here today launching the brand Ushindi, now in the colors of Pwani and in the reformulated, improved, bolstered, and answering consumer need kind of formulation of the new Ushindi soap in its multipurpose tablets. And we also introduced to you a very new formulation, best in the world, best in the business in Kenya for sure, in terms of the Ushindi cream 
bar in 175 gram, 800 gram, and one kilo. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Ushindi in Pwani's fraternity. We hope that with Ushindi, and when it comes to you next, in your orders soon, we will be able to aid you make more money, and you aid us in continuing to innovate, create, and send to Kenyans the answers to the needs of those consumers that we serve. So you can see some of the products that we've taken over from the Ushindi formula formulated brands in the market and you will have also seen some of the new introductions that we'll be bringing to you in the market in the brand name of Ushindi. Ushindi cream ladies and gentlemen, Ushindi cream has been formulated to be able to come to the last bit of its soap, lasts longer, lathers more, forms more and definitely costs less per kilo in terms of your usage and the amount of clothing, dishwashing and bathing that you would be able to do with this bar. The formulation allows for the soap to continue to form right up to the end of its use. Ladies and gentlemen, as we continue to formulate new products and new innovations in this new brand name, we also promise that we will continue to supply to the market the existing Ushindi brand products in the products like Ushindi dishwashing paste, Ushindi dishwashing liquid, Ushindi liquid detergents, etc. And those will be coming to you in the next two to three months. I want to say that we are going to support this brand like we've supported every other Pony innovation and every other Pony brand and we want to make this the market leader with your help and support, with the strong distribution that you continue to offer us, with us, we will make this a big brand for the years to come. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say here, Pwani Kapata Ushindi.